Oh, and look at this fox! Isn't it just one of the most beautiful things you've ever seen? Ah, but all right guys, hello and welcome back to Meadow. And it has just been so beautiful lately as the spring weather has been arriving. Our warrior cats are having their kittens. Our star stable foals are frolicking in the fields. And I felt like returning to a old favorite by jumping back into Meadow for a while. And just look at all of this greenery. It's so beautiful. And it has been so beautiful in real life lately too, you guys. I hope you have been going outside enjoying this lovely spring weather. If you're lucky enough to have some of the spring weather, it took a long time to get to us in Michigan. But finally, the daffodils are coming up and there's crocus all over the place. And oh, just thinking about those beautiful flowers. We need to go find some flowers while we're here in the meadow too. The more flowers you gather, the more essential experience you gain and the more experience you gain. You can end up with a cute little den and oh, that'd just be so much fun. It has been so long since I've been back in the meadow and I'm sure there's so many surprises just waiting for us right around the corner. All right, we need to look, we need to find some friends. Hello? 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 What? Hello? Hello? Hmm. Hello? Where are Who's you hiding? That? What? Who are you? Who are you? I'm a badger. What kind of badger? Are you the kind that eats bunnies? Yes. Are you a bunny? What? Okay, no, I'm not you. a bunny. I will find you. <laughs> Where? Where are you? I'm underneath the big tree. <laughs> are you here? I may be. I'm running in a circle. I'm just completely <laughs> running in a circle. You don't sound like the kind of badger who eats flower or eats bunnies. I'm gonna try. Oh yeah? <gasps> Hello. Hello. I'm pretty sure I could outrun you if I tried. <laughs> you probably could. <laughs> Hello. It's Siri, the pixel biologist. Hello, everyone. Welcome. It's very I'm good to so see you. I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. Why? What is it? What do we do? Is it going to kill it's us? It's okay. I think it's a duck. It's a it's, pheasant. No, it's a pheasant. It's the new pheasant. <gasps> oh, it's very, it's very, it's very pretty. Okay, Siri. Attack on three. <laughs> <laughs> or is that not is that not what we do in Meadow? <laughs> not in Meadow. In Meadow, we eat flowers. Okay, so teach me the ways of Meadow, because you have played this on your channel, have you not? I have, and it's very beautiful. The ways of Meadow are basically the ways of running around aimlessly collecting flowers and appreciating surprisingly uh, unique discoveries that you can find. Okay, so that sounds like I'm going to be horrible at it, because <laughs> I have to be honest, when I have played all of the shelter games, I it completely ignored- oh, bye, pheasant. Um, I completely ignored all of the collectibles, like every, every game. Did you- you strike me as someone who got all of the collectibles. Well, I, I wish I could say I did, but I'm afraid <laughs> anytime I saw a pretty plant, I immediately was drawn off course. So ironically, Meadow suits me very well because it's all about collecting very lovely flowers. Look at us! We're best friends! <laughs> I don't think... I'm, I'm highly suspicious that badgers and rabbits in real life are best friends. Uh, you know, I would like to say there's a there's a good chance, but um, at least here in Meadow we don't have to worry about it. Everybody's friends here. Nobody can attack each other. It's just peaceful and lovely. Wow. Okay. So I mean, yeah. What do we What do we do? Well, I could show you some cool uh, little discoveries I found. There you are, little baby badger. I don't I don't know what I'm doing. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. <laughs> well, so what are all these things that I'm looking at on the left side of my screen? I see like. Oh. Oh, you are looking at your emotes. Do I want to hide those? Oh, I can hide them all. You can. Oh, but what are they? So you can't talk here in Meadow. I mean, we're talking to each other, but that's a very special. Uh, oh yes, I very can. Look special at me. circumstance. Well, okay, yeah, you can cheer up. That's really cute. <laughs> I'm making bunny noises. You just do? can't tell. No! no! <laughs> Am I dead? You're okay. Am I dead? Am I, am I going to start here, a forest here, fire? Here. No, it's all right. I've got this. I've got this. I'll put some little rain clouds on it. Did you just make it rain? I, I brought the rain and little tiny moons. You're a magic bunny. It's a special skill I've gained. Okay, I think I should hide those because I'm not, <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm bad. Those will be your special actions you can do if you want to show somebody something unique. And then the emotes are if you want to be able to say hello to others. <gasps> Oh, like that so. was so cute! Or like so. You're sticking your tongue out! 
<laughs> oh my then, goodness. But probably we won't need them because we'll be able to talk to each other. But usually... This, I could see myself literally just like starting to live like a second life online as a badger. You can actually make a little den. You could make that happen. <laughs> you can? You can. Like my own den. You can mark your own den and then it'll make you show up there every time. So you'll have a little home spot. Oh my goodness, I want to do that. <laughs> and what other animals can you be? Oh, you could be frogs, you could be goats. You you saw the pheasant, but I think the one that you'd probably love the most is the fox. You can be a fox. You can be a fox. Wait a minute, you can be a fox, but like you still can't. Can I? Okay, Siri, I'm going to ask a question. That, Don't I'm, get mad I've at got me. Answers. No, okay. no, it's all right. Don't get mad at me. Okay. Can I kill anything? Nope. <laughs> Okay. All right. That's fine. That's fine. Oh, well, wait. That's probably good then. So can I can I be killed? No. Oh, okay. I like this game then. Where should right. we go? Here, what I'll show you some of my favorite areas. I think there's a couple can, spots you'll really enjoy. We can talk and we can walk. Oh, you're sprinting. Okay. Yep. I could probably right, go I a can... lot faster than you, so I'll walk next to you. I, well, I can sprint. All right. Let's see it then. Is it going to be uh. the race of the hare and the badger? No, I mean I'm I'm not gonna win, but like I can. <laughs> which way? Which way are we going? We'll go over here into the flower fields, and I'll show you one of my. Oh, what's this? What's this? What did you? What? What? Oh, it's another badger. Hello. Oh, and there's the pheasant again. All right, bye, Siri. I'm with my own kind. <laughs> Hello. Just wait till you find a mama badger. She might try to take you under her paw. Oh, am I a baby? You're a baby badger. Oh, how big are badgers in the wild? My goodness. Oh my, they're quite large. I've never seen a badger in the wild, ever. They could be a little intimidating. Oh, I love the music. Wait, is the sun... <gasps> Siri, can it get night? It can indeed. The time can change. The seasons are here. We could go and explore the section that has your favorite season if you wanted to. Ooh. What is your favorite season, actually? Well, I love the fall. Ooh. That's probably my favorite. Although in shelter, I also love the snow a lot. Oh, there's so many places to show you then. Ugh, really? Okay. How big is this world? Oh, it's so big. It's full of so many beautiful things. So, Oh my goodness. I'll give you a riddle. You're going to have to choose where to go first. Would okay. you like to go see the snow or would you like to go see the cave full of gemstones? <gasps> what the? It's what? It's Whoa. You. <laughs> it's a goat. Oh, he's so cool! Hello, That's Mr. Goat. goat! Everybody is super friendly here. You don't have to worry. Everyone in the meadow just wants to help each other out with finding I'm gonna back old up and be his friends. Look there you go. Friends with a goat. Oh, oh, how do I say hi? How do I say hi? <laughs> Your commands, you'll just wave at them. Oh, oh no! Oh. I'm crying. No, no, I'm sorry, I'm happy! <laughs> I, meant, I meant to be happy! Oh, there you go. Oh, no. I told them I was sad. It's okay. Everybody will just think, oh, it's a frog. <gasps> Don't panic. Ooh. It's not a beetle. <laughs> Hello. Hi. Oh Look my at gosh. his little cheeks. That's the best. This is incredible. Okay. So wait, what was the riddle? Would you like to see the cave full of gemstones or the snow first? How, how is that a riddle? Hmm. Well, it's more of a choice. You have to okay. pick a path. Cave of gemstones or the snow. I'll go for the cave of gemstones. All right, that'll be this way. You ready? I keep backing up instead <laughs> of walking forward. I don't know why. Oh, uh, that's so cute. I'm uh, I'm getting there. Okay, I'm ready. All Where right. are we going? We're gonna go this direction. Just let me know if you I lose keep sight. Keep backing up. Wait, why can't I go forward? <laughs> it's okay. It's your very first baby badger steps. But I'm just not good at it. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready. All right, you've got the right direction. Head forward. You got this. All right, where are we going? All right, so we're going to go through all of these beautiful flower fields and towards that mountain that's kind of ahead of us a bit. Okay, so you're saying that we could be a lynx. We could be a bear. A lynx, I'm a badger. Bear you're a rabbit. Yep. We've seen goats and we've seen frogs pheasants and, pheasants. and fo frogs. Mm -hmm. Frogs. Um, how many animal types are there? And you said that there's a fox. Oh, there's a beautiful fox. The fox is really envied. Everybody who can become a fox kind of gets, uh, gets pretty popular pretty fast. <gasps> I will be a fox then, Siri. <laughs> we'll try to break open some rune stones. I'll teach you about breaking those open so that you can earn your fox puzzle pieces. Okay. I'm just stuck on this tree. <laughs> All right. I'm coming, Siri. <laughs> You're Okay. 
Very first baby Lead badger steps. All right, so come this way, follow me a little to the right, and we're gonna okay. try. Oh wait, look, it's this, your very first this food. Tree, this tree is magical. All right, you see the sparkly bit? Why am bit? I so bad at running? Hold on. <laughs> I'm really, really bad at it. Um, there you go. <gasps> there you I go. got it. You did it. Did I eat it? Yep. Okay, wait. So how often do I have to eat? You only, or is it just for fun? It's just for fun. And the more oh. experience you gain, the more you have access to going to different places. Nothing's really locked, but I think you need like 2,000 in order to have a den of your own. How many do I have? You can check if you go up to... Do, do, do. Actually, I forgot where to check. Hang on, just a second. Hmm, it's a good question. It's a mystery. It's a mystery. You'll know. You'll know when the day comes upon you. Oh, That you'll be okay. able to make a den. Well, I probably have like one of 2,000, so... <laughs> probably, to be honest. All right, which way, Siri? All right, let's go this way. There's almost like a little path in the ground right here, backing it seems. Up again. <laughs> oh, now the path is over. Oh, are you backing up? I'm fine. I'm fine. I'll get there. <laughs> Maybe I need to be a different animal. I'm not sure. It's just getting used to the first steps. It'll it'll get a little easier as time goes on. And anytime you see something shiny, you can eat that, and that'll help give you a little bit of experience. It's good for you. I mean, did did you grow up being told you have to eat your greens? I yeah, I was, and I honestly hated vegetables as a kid. <gasps> Do you still hate them? No. I And actually, I like a lot of vegetables that a lot of people don't like for some reason. Like, I love peas. Oh, I love peas too. Oh, good. I don't know why people don't like peas. What about um, Brussels sprouts? I love Brussels sprouts. See, I, I knew we had similar taste. Hey, Siri, I'm lost. Oh, I think I lost you. <laughs> <laughs> don't worry, I'm coming back. <laughs> we just got, got on the talk of Brussels sprouts and... I on the dog of delicious Brussels sprouts. I don't know so. what happened. Oh, there you are, little lost oh, badger. Oh, okay, I was going the right way, I'm sorry. No, you're good. So here's another trick. If you see in the bottom right, there's a map. And if you click the map... No, I don't have a map. I don't have a map. You don't have a map? No. You... No? No. Did you hide everything? Yeah, I, I hid everything. Okay. Show, show it, and then you can click to the very, very right. Yeah, and the it'll... show button went away too. Oh, don't panic! Just wave your wave. Oh, there your... it is. There you go. Okay, I still don't see. Oh, there's the map. And when you click on it, it'll come up for just a second, and you'll see all Whoa. those diamonds running around. Are those all players? Those are all players. You can no look way. behind us, and you can see. Oh, here, maybe there's a fox. Oh, there's that you mountains. Can see. What does this one do? Let's see if I can jump up and get a good view. Oh, there goes an eagle. Oh no, that's a pheasant. I have no animals that I can change to. I don't think. Wait, what? Whoops! Whoa! All right, let's see. Looks like there's a big group headed inside the gemstone cave, so we might meet <gasps> up with them in a minute. Okay, I'm gonna jump here. Jump, Stacy. Jump. You did it. You did it. Good job. All right. All right, you're on the right track. See, you're learning it. Thanks. So, for those people who don't know, you basically have a YouTube channel where you also have a huge love of animals. Oh, I am a deep lover of animals. I am a biologist by nature. I think you're a little bit- I think you're a little bit more of a lover of animals than I am, because I would say I'm like, a lover of mammals? I will- well, I will and admit I, really I love bats. Don't know. And I know I how really you feel about know. bats. <laughs> I've made peace with bats. I've- I've, I've made peace with bats. But I, I really don't know that much about, like, birds? Oh. Or, like, reptiles? Those! Or... Yes. I also don't know that much about plants, and I feel like you know lots about plants and birds and reptiles. That pretty much covers all of my obsessions in life right there. Have you ever had, like, um, have you ever had a pet that's, like, a mammal? A mammal? Oh, yeah, I've had dogs, I've had bunnies, oh, okay. I've had cats. I've had bunnies, too! <gasps> You've had bunnies? I've had a bunny. His name was D'Artagnan. D'Artagnan, that is a beautiful- <laughs> How did you come up with D'Artagnan? I didn't. Some old guy did who owned the bunny, <laughs> and he also litter box trained him. Oh, and then wow. they gave him to me, and I, being like the really original six-year-old that I was, w like was like, I'm gonna name him Petey Boy. Oh, that's adorable. So he wasn't D'Artagnan anymore. He was Petey Boy, and he was this beautiful black litter box trained rabbit. <gasps> oh, here What's goes that animal over the box? there? Oh my gosh! Oh, oh, how do I say hi? Hi, hi, hi. No, wait. Oh, hi, hi, hi. No, <laughs> oh, you're crying hi again. again. No, come back. 
Wait, there's like two fox skins. <gasps> yep, there's multiple fox skins. You can unlock dozens Wait, of different why am I... skins. I want to. I want to chase the foxes. Turn around, Stacy. Look alive. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm horrible. Here, we can go chase them if you want. I'm. I mean, Run I'm not gonna it. keep up, but I have to try. Where'd they go? And if you check, if you look at your map, you can actually kind of keep track of where all those diamonds run off to. That was magical, Siri, because it's so crazy to me that those foxes were like actual people somewhere in the world. Somewhere out there, and they're spending their time in the meadow, and you can and they run with them. Didn't stop and say hi. <laughs> I well, bet you they're did. searching for so stones. Well, and then oh. you did cry. They may have thought maybe you were I'm a little sorry. nervous. <laughs> I know. Oh no, they probably think I'm like such a weird badger. Oh no, no, they probably. I really should not be a badger. Like I think I'm really slow. Look at this waterfall. Oh, there you are. Sorry. See, no, you're I'm... fine. I'm the trying badger to keep cubs, up. The, if you recall from uh, your experience as a badger mother, the cubs may not move the quickest sometimes. What happens? Is this like the edge of the world? Yep. Oh. I've never tried to jump off of it. Oh. <laughs> so I'm not sure what happened. Scary. Oh no! <laughs> Stacy! I didn't mean it was an auto thing. I'm plummeting to the ground! <gasps> Stacy, what have you done? <laughs> it's, everything's dark now. No! <laughs> There's a pheasant here just staring down after you with me. I'm here, I'm back, I'm back. Uh, okay. do you see me? Are you are you back next to me? If you hit run forward, I like it was stuck or something. Oh my goodness. I wanted to jump at the same time. <laughs> oh <laughs> you dear. should do it. It's pretty funny. You just plummet for the longest time. It was kind of sad. Oh my goodness. Um, I don't know. Oh wait, I think I saw you. Okay, I'm coming. <laughs> Are you? Oh, you're back there. Yeah, I'm up here. There we go. Sorry about that. The pheasant's That's like, fine. this is a peculiar badger. The pheasant just stood there with question marks over its head. <laughs> it was pretty amazing. Oh, man. Well, don't do that. That was... I think I did find out how to die in this game. You were gently lifted back up and put back onto the grass. So, at least you're in one piece. I was. So, if you don't mind me asking, what pets do you have at the moment? At the moment, I have birds and geckos. See? Birds and reptiles. Yep, birds and reptiles. Birds and reptiles. I have never owned a bird or a reptile. No, that's not true. I had turtles as a kid. Oh, you had turtles too? Yeah, we would find them like on the side of the road. Oh, and like box would... turtles. Yeah, box turtles. Oh, Stacy, the pheasant's trying to lead us to a runestone. Pheasant, I will follow you. So if we follow him, he may take us to one of the runestones where you can start breaking things open uh, the, and get puzzle pieces to unlock the new animals. Mm. Ah, there's one right over there. It's not even in a runestone. Wonderful. Okay, but what's a runestone? Oh, you'll know when you see one. I'll try to find one for you and share it with you. But all right, there you are. Fantastic. Ooh. Go ahead and snag <gasps> that. Okay, I got it. Let me say how happy I am. Oh, yay, I thought you were gonna cry again. <laughs> I know, I really had to think <laughs> about it. <laughs> oh, and the pheasant's just doing the happy dance. Thank you, pheasant. Oh. All right, We're and if all you so go, happy. Let's see. So if you click on the circle next to the map, that'll oh. open up all of the puzzle pieces that you have for the things that you're currently working on unlocking. Circle next to the map. Where did it go? Here it is. Okay. I have one emote. Yep. So if you get three more, you'll have a new emotion that you can share with everyone. Oh, okay. All right. All right. I just want to know how to get the fox, okay? That would be getting, do you see the big giant uh, square to your left? Uh -huh. That's the animal. And you need to unlock the different animals by collecting up all those puzzle pieces. Oh, gosh. It takes a little while, but hopefully we'll find that fox group and we'll be able to crack open some runestones. Okay. Oh, and I think there's a flower over here, but yes. Oh, yeah, there's another emote piece. Here, <gasps> we can get you more emotions than like crying and waving. Wait, so like when I'm taking them, are you not able to get them? Nope, or can everybody you get gets them to too? share. What a beautiful community. Isn't it awesome? There, I. There oh, you go. I, now you've got I two. Kind of overshot them. it. <laughs> oh my gosh. Walk this way, Stacy. There we go. There we go. I heard you get it. <laughs> 
and back up. That's so adorable. <laughs> you just have like a little little badger backup that you've got going. All right, you ready? Uh, I'm ready. Leave me to this this cave of wonders. All right, we lost the fox group, but they'll probably run I by know, us again. Oh, I know. Uh, where'd you go? I just Oop. totally lost you. There you are. All right, right over here. I'll jump up. Let's see if I up oh, up oh, up. Oh. Where'd you go, oh. little badger? Oh, there you go. How did you? How fast are you? That I complete. Okay, okay, hi. Hi. All right. So which way? This way. Well, this way. Towards towards. Um, I'm gonna call it Stacy's leap from now on. Okay. So yes. So we're going towards was, Stacy's leap. That was unfortunate. <laughs> so do you actually like one of the things I was really bad about in the shelter games was actually like learning the maps and knowing where to go. Do you, like, this is the map always, right? Like, it's yes. not different every time you log in? Nope. It'll stay the same. And I'm very lucky because that passion for plants I have uh, really plays out for me. Because I remember, I that's bet. the pretty tree. That's the pretty waterfall. That's the other pretty tree. See, I'm just like, everything is just green to, <laughs> to me. <laughs> oh, so you actually weird. know your way around this forest. For the most part. For the most part. That's cool. It's a little bit helpful when you're trying to get from place to place, but I haven't really explored the snowy area very much yet, so that might be exciting Ooh, to share with yeah. you. yeah. And is the rabbit, like, your favorite animal to play as? He's so cute because he eats flowers. Oh, that is cute. <laughs> so I thought it would be fun to play as him and run around today eating flowers. Um, is there the a skunk? Goat. No, no skunk. <gasps> Somebody needs to tell them that there needs to be a skunk. Imagine the cute little emotes that skunk could have. Yes, there's skunks by my cabin. <gasps> really? Yeah, I'm sure there'll be a vlog soon that's like bathing the dogs in tomato juice. I was just about to ask if the dogs had seen the skunk. No, but it's <laughs> probably only a matter of time. Oh, no. All right, so we should find the cave soon, too. My dream is to find, like, an abandoned baby skunk. Oh, just a little one? Yeah. And then, like, domesticate it. Because I think you can get them... Uh, like descented somehow. I don't you know if can. that's cruel though. That uh, might be I cruel. That might be like getting a cat declawed. It, I think it's kind of like getting ferrets descented, where you don't want to do it all the way. Um, you could. I know nothing about ferrets. Ferrets have scent. <gasps> yeah, ferrets. Have, their ferrets are very stinky. They're wonderful. I don't trust. Don't ferrets. get me wrong, but they're very stinky. Have you really? ever held a ferret? No. They're basically like holding a furry slinky. I'm really into what is that group of animals called? Like mustelids or something? Or mustelids? Is that right? I don't know. That's, that's ringing right. bells. I feel embarrassed. But it's like ferret and like ermine, uh, which is also called like the stout. I think. Oh, the little cute stouts! They're yes, adorable. They're so cute. And I, I recently discovered because I had this wallpaper that I got from my cabin, and it has all these animal faces on it, like foxes and bears and deer and raccoons. But there was one animal and I couldn't figure out what it is. And I finally figured out that it's either a stout or a pine marten. Oh, and, and those then are both very beautiful. I looked up. I, I want to say the word is mustelid. It's going to be really embarrassing if it's not. But I looked them up and there's just all these animals I didn't even know existed. That just basically look like ferrets. That, yep, just like little ferrets or ermines. Or, but they're just all that. different kinds, like otters and all that stuff. This what? is a cool area. Isn't it pretty? It's very I'm lovely, so kind of like slow as a badger. <laughs> do you think? Do you think you need to take on the essence of another creature? Ooh, how do I do that? Yes, please. <laughs> I mean, then, I love this guy, but I would like to be—I don't know—something. Something, something else. a little bit with maybe some longer legs might help. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How do I do that? All right. It's gonna. It might take a moment. Okay. Okay. You're gonna okay. have to go back to your den. Oh, then we'll do it in the next episode. Okay. Lead the way to the gemstones. Really? I have to go back to my den? Yep. Well, not all the way back to, uh, basically back to the start screen. Oh. To put it outside of, yep. <laughs> Look at me, like, jump. Jumped with, with reckless abandon. And then I'm going to dash ahead of you just to make sure we're going, oh, that's a flower. It's a yummy, yummy looking flower. Okay. I'll stand over You're here. You're really, really excited about this flower. flower. Oh, it's so pretty, Stacy. When you see it, you'll understand. Oh, yeah, I guess so. <laughs> yes. Kind of like a iris kind of a thing. <laughs> yes, very pretty flower. You yeah. got to appreciate the just beauty of things. I find if you get excited about little things like that, then your whole day is awesome. 
I'm not good about that. I'm not good about plants. I need to get better <laughs> about plants. And then let's see. I'm gonna see. I know where we've got the cave around here somewhere. Life as a bunny means you're a little shorter than life as a lynx. Mm. So everything looks a teensy bit different, but I recognize this river. That's one of the things I loved most about the first shelter game was how low, like I felt so vulnerable as a badger. <sighs> Like I was scared of the water. I was scared of the fire. I was like, uh, it was, it was scary. Whoa! Is that the cave? That purple thing? Yep. <gasps> I'm really excited to share this with you. It's so beautiful inside. It's cool looking. It's like a, an actual like cavern. Oh, just wait till you get inside. And I have to ask you, have you heard about the cave of crystals in Mexico? No. Oh, I know about like. You know, I grew up kind of, I grew up in Virginia, so I grew up near Luray Caverns. Um, whoa! Okay, wait, there's, do we have to swim to it? Just a little bit. It's not too big of a swim. Oh my gosh, you just jumped into the... Okay, here we go. <laughs> you got this! <gasps> oh my goodness. But I would say that this place is actually, when you see how stunning it is, based off of a real cave that's in Mexico called the Cave of Crystals. And the crystals are easily, I think, something like 20 feet long. They're probably six or seven feet in diameter. They're gigantic and gorgeous. And there's actually a place like that in real life that will look like this. And you'll see how pretty it is inside. This is the coolest thing. There's nothing like this in the any of the shelter games. Nope, this is totally something quite different. And I'll See, I don't know. I guess when I first thought of like when I first heard about Meadow, I assumed that we were just playing in the maps that already existed oh, no. in all of the games. I I fell. <laughs> Hang I'm in there. coming. The thing that's hard for me is I can never understand what is just the pattern of the rock or yep. what is like some type of like, you know, rune that I'm Oops. supposed to, you know, run across, interpret or something. <gasps> but do we, can we like get out of here? Or do we, is it basically like an out and back kind of a situation? Oh, there's, there's an area to get out of in the back. We just have to swim through here first. This has kind of become like a little like slot canyon. Well, I mean, I guess it's still a cave. Wow. Oh, it'll open up. There we go. Oh, the crystals are starting to show up. They're so pretty. I, I don't think a badger in real life could really keep up with it, a rabbit. <laughs> I think I would be very tired by now. Especially because you're the badger cub at the moment, too. Oh my gosh. Jump, badger cub. Jump. Let me can't jump my out way of water. Up. You can't do it. There we go. What do you mean the crystals are starting to show up? Where? What do you mean? All right. Oh, there you are. I'm here. There was a crystal or two on the side, and I promise you, the cave oh, of no. crystals has a lot more. How did you make that go. jump? I have oh, very long go. legs. There here, like there, there's a little crystal right here in front of me, but this is what? nothing compared to what we're about to see. What? What? See right here on the ground? That's a crystal? That's a little crystal. I okay. promise you, there's more impressive ones. All right. that's No, this whole thing is very cool. Let's I'm see. excited to be ah, here. There we go. Now we're on the right path. Oh, there's mushrooms! <gasps> Mushroom? They're so cute! See, you would eat these as a little badger. Can I eat them? Nope, just flowers. <gasps> Did you hear? I echoed! <laughs> I know, isn't it cute? That's such a cute little detail. If you jump in the water, the echo will actually go through the cave, too. Oh my goodness. And then moving over here, is this it? Yes, now this I'm excited for you to see. Okay, what is it? Okay, just remember. <gasps> Whoop. Oh, there you are. I'm, I'm okay. I thought you saw something behind us, and I was like, what is it? Is it a really cool no, mushroom? No, I just see the, I see the big rocks up ahead. There are those huge go. crystals? Yep, these pink <gasps> things. Oh my goodness. I'm surrounded by them. It gets very, very pretty up ahead. What? Like, it's already gorgeous. <laughs> this way? Yep, straight up. Okay. And then you, as you walk through, you can see just how lovely it is. So how do you get the different textures of like the fox? Like you have to unlock, you, once you get the fox, do you have all of them or do you have to unlock the different textures too? You unlock them and here we go. Now the light gets a little bit brighter. I'm really scared now that there's like, 
types of foxes that you could only get like at the beginning of the game, like limited edition or something. <gasps> no, no, thankfully there's nothing like that. So oh, it's good. completely relaxed. You don't have to stress. You can just run around in the pretty, pretty places. I feel like I'm obsessed with this game now. This is one of my favorite places to come to relax, <gasps> to be honest. Oh my gosh. Isn't it lovely? This is so cool! I feel so bad I waited so long to play Meadow! <laughs> it's very beautiful. I love coming here and like I said, I think because I know that there's somewhere out there in the world that does look like this, it makes it even more special to me. Wow. Did the caves you were in recently have anything like this? Uh, no. <laughs> Not like this. This is pretty magical. I love how it sounds like they're humming. It does. It sounds very... Ooh, there's like an incline over there. Explore. You don't know what you might find. There's a lot of hidden blossoms that will be tucked away in really hard to find places. Alright, I'm gonna... I'm gonna come up here. Being a tiny badger may feel like a disadvantage now, but there's places that you'll find that you're just perfect for being able to fit in that the goats and pheasants wouldn't be able to reach. Perfect. Come on, badger. Oh, oh there's a I shadow. think it's a dead end. That's so yeah, cool. what's the shadow? Oh it's, oh, it's me! Yeah! It's me! Hi, hi! Hello! <laughs> Where's your shadow? Right under me. Right where it belongs. <laughs> Um, okay, so this was a dead end. Can you make it down? Oh, I can make it down. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Just do my little backwards walking. There you go. So this is the Cave of Crystals, and it is one of my favorite places to come. There's just something so relaxing about it. It's really cool. I think one of the things I like most is I used to teach cave science uh, to elementary school kids and I taught in a cave actually, like a real life cave. So we had our <laughs> classroom inside of a cave and I would teach everybody about how a stalactite and stalagmite often take up to a thousand years just to grow an inch. Is that true? An inch? An inch. Oh my goodness. So we had I always pieces. remember the mnemonic of uh, what is it? Stalac... So, okay, so... Did you, oh! Hey! 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 Oh. Hey! 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 <gasps> oh, up, look at that! Back up, back up! And forward and jump! Perfect! <sighs> oh, it's getting really dark. That would be night coming, and then I got a new emotion! You did? What can you do? I can uh, be sassy. Yeah, you look, like, determined. <laughs> I've, I'm filled with determination and ready. <laughs> ready just, for adventure. We're back out of this cave. Here. <laughs> so here. Backing out. <laughs> Look at my footprints! Yep. Wait, have we had footprints this whole time? It depends on if we're in muddy areas or not. I just noticed them. Very tiny little details that just will show up one after another. Alright, I'm gonna practice the controls between the episodes. <laughs> You've totally got this. So, I always remembered stalactite has a C in it, and C is for ceiling. And stalag might has a G. Yep. And G is for ground. Yep, that's one way to do it. And if you're really bad with spelling like me, then I remember stalag tights hold tight to the ceiling, and stalag mites might grow up to be big one day. <laughs> oh, that's adorable, Siri. <laughs> well, wait, it's not night. Now we're out, so maybe it was just the cave. I hope huh. we were. I hope we didn't like. Whew. Oh well, I'm not going to question Siri? it. Siri. Yes. Is that, like, a desert over there? Desert? Oh, I think that might be the autumn area. Or a whole new area. They are constantly adding new areas. Oh my gosh, I'm just saying from here, it almost looks like a mesa. Hey, you want to go check it out? Maybe in the next episode. Yep. You, I think your badger legs are probably tired. <laughs> yeah. Maybe <laughs> I will change animals and we will check it out in the next episode. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for watching this first episode of Metal. Let me know what you think and go over and check out Siri's amazing channel and subscribe. I will leave her link in the description. That was adorable. <laughs> Isn't it? That was so cute. <laughs> All right, guys. I will see you later. But until next time, Paige and Molly love you. Go rescue a dog. Bye, guys.